Does douching promote cleanliness and prevent infections? This is a common belief, but the truth might surprise you. Intravaginal cleansing or douching has been a common practice for personal hygiene, aesthetic reasons, and even with the intent of preventing or treating infections. For over a century, there have been conflicting views on whether this practice is beneficial or harmful. The practice of douching has a long historical precedent. However, over the years, medical professionals have raised concerns about its safety and effectiveness. The feminine douching products market, nevertheless, continues to grow, with an estimated increase of $48.4 million between 2022 and 2027. But what does science say about douching? Well, it turns out that this practice might not be as beneficial as it seems. In fact, it can disrupt the natural balance of the vagina. By altering the normal vaginal pH and flora, douching weakens the vagina's natural defenses, making it more susceptible to the overgrowth of pathogens. Furthermore, the process of inserting fluid intravaginally can push harmful bacteria further up into the reproductive tract. While rinsing the vaginal cavity might give an illusion of cleanliness, it is usually more harmful than helpful. The naturally acidic environment of the vagina is its own protector against infections, and douching can upset this balance. So, is douching bad for you? The answer is yes. Douching changes the chemical balance in your vagina, leaving you susceptible to various types of infection, and it can also damage your fallopian tubes, increasing the risk of a future ectopic pregnancy. If you're concerned about a sudden vaginal odor, Consider dietary changes or a new supplement you might have started. If the odor persists with discharge, it may be a sign of infection, and you should see your healthcare provider right away. In summary, the vagina has its own natural self-cleaning mechanisms, and it doesn't need help. So next time you're considering douching, remember, it's best to let nature take its course. Your body knows best.